the, the water was rationed. We didn't have no more food left in the hospital. They didn't have no more sheets and no more blankets. The medicine was scarce. Uh, I was supposed to get out Wednesday, and I ended up after staying there for uh, just evacuated yesterday. There was so much of a mandatory evac evacuation. They had all kind of holes. They brought us in here on an 18-wheeler truck, truck in the back of an 18-wheeler truck. And two days ago, I was on the fourth floor, and and uh, the window above me was shot out by, by a sniper. And they had glass flying all over, and, and the bullets were flying. Everybody was scared in the hospital. They've come from all over the place, and hospitals, nursing homes, you name it, they came from it. So they're coming through here, we're triaging them, assigning priority, stabil stabilizing any patients, any critical patients. We move out of here as quickly as possible, we'll evac back out. The rest of the patients, we are evacing out by um, military transport and their military evac hospitals. It's all over the country.